A very modern experiment is underway at some Ottawa schools. High school students are working with grade three students to design iPhone applications. Mm -hmm. It's part of a growing effort to get young people interested in careers in technology. Here's CTV's Paul Brent. Yeah, you can do any colors you want. You can, work. You can draw stars, you can draw hearts, you can draw lungs. Make sure you play the game and tell them anything that you don't like about it. Our game is basically, it's for grade three students and it asks them math questions. The goal to produce a series of iPhone apps like this partially completed math game. Grade nine and ten designers talk to grade three students about what they want. The grade three is also doing some of the artwork that will be part of the graphic look of the game. These girls, they actually give us feedback, right? Like if we had a digital customer, mm -hmm. they wouldn't give us much feedback. Like we come and they're like, well, we like this, but the colors don't really work, right? So I think that's really cool. I just like like um, inventing a new game or something like that, and I just like um, working on it with other people. I think it has a really big cool factor with both levels to give them an understanding of how it really works under the hood and to show them that they can succeed and actually create something for it I think is really powerful. Coxell guides the high school students. He has all the necessary approvals to be like an official colors? Apple Apps developer. By early next year he hopes to have a half dozen of the apps completed. They're fearless. I mean not like their teacher, they're not like, they're like in there touching. <laughs> you know, my am going, uh, can I touch? And they're like, oh, let's touch. So there's no, uh, I mean this is the world that they're living in. Tapping into brain power, motivating youth to consider tech as a career. That's why corporate backers like IBM and Adobe have come on board. They can show those students how to do things that they never even imagined were possible and show them how easy they are. And this inspires them to say, you know what, I want to be a creative technology. I don't want to just be a consumer. We can't just keep going uh, every year doing, you know, five, five grade 10 classes. We need to really, really go broader to make a difference. The Ottawa Centre for Research and Innovation has been slowly building this program for a few years. They I hope it's getting to the point where the schools and the private sector will get involved and take the program from a few classrooms into many schools. Paul Brent, CTV News.